Alright guys, it's March the 10th, um, 2015, um, about, I would say almost a year ago, I did one of these, um, batches of toy parts, um, I look into getting these online, like, pre-done, but they are really expensive, um, <clears throat> for example, if you were to order something like this, I haven't found any in local, um, but in the states so I'm in Canada they charge about five dollars for like about a dozen pieces this thing is 20 pieces and it's a dollar not including coloring of course uh, the ones online are pre-colored so they're ready to go but um, this is all made of pine because um, I asked the store I bought this before um, so all the beads you see here and these these ones are 54 pieces. I have three bags. You guys can do the math. Uh, four bags. You guys can do the math on it. These are spools, and there is 13 pieces. And I have three bags. The beads ones, these fancier looking beads, there's 28 pieces per bag, and I have eight bags. I think I bought a total of 23. And these ones, there's 80 pieces, and it's rounded beads. And I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So no matter how you know you calculate this, it will still be cheaper than buying the pre-done ones online. Um, at ninety-nine cents each, I paid twenty-five fifty for the beads. Um, I looked into getting. I haven't added this up, but I looked at approximately. Uh, I believe it was 10,000 pieces. Um, I was ordering from a wood bead store, uh, well, a company, uh, not including freight, not including customs fee at the door possibly, and not including the U.S. exchange, which was about $70. It was around $300 for the order. And so about 400 I was looking at about $400, and um, it wasn't colored yet even. I had to still color it. Um, so I'm guessing... I'm going to get a better price by doing this. It's probably only going to cost me $100. I wiped out the store. That's the reason I don't have more. I would have bought more. Um, so anyway, so that was $25.50. Um, about a year ago, I bought food coloring as well, and I paid $21.77. This is a educational store, so I get a discount if I go with my mother, who's a teacher. So they were $6.75 each, a regular price, and they're... Food coloring so it's a pretty big one um, this this is a one liter so it's a pretty big bottle um, if you were to go to like the grocery stores and buy the teeny tiny ones it would be those teeny tiny ones in a four pack for one of these so I bought I think I bought blue yellow and red um, so I'll be mixing some colors um, but altogether, right now, I'm only looking at fifty dollars. So I was originally potentially spending four hundred on non-colored beads, and I've only spent fifty dollars. Um, and I'm still getting more. I bought some loofahs as well. It's in my bedroom. Um, but I think I spent, I think I spent about twenty-five dollars on that. But uh, they're the loofahs that you take to the shower, but they're natural. And I just cut the string off, and then I expand them. And I'll be doing a video on that when I do it. I bought dehydrator trays. I have a dehydrator, but I bought five more packs of trays. Um, so I'll have ten more trays. They come in packs of two. And uh, I think I spent 125 on that. So even if I calculate the accessories that I'm buying, I'm still saving. Um, the reason I bought more trays is so I can dry them faster. I was going to do it air dry, but I remember last time it took several days because of the batch of them that I had and the amount of racks that I had to dry them on. It took a long time, so I'm going to try doing it in the dehydrator. Uh, I am going to use parchment paper this time because I don't want to stain my new trays. Uh, I just don't have parchment paper, so I'm going to have to go get some. That shouldn't be too expensive, right? Um, so anyway, that's all.